Hello, Galaxy of Heroes. So, uh, th this is actually a video that I haven't, well, a style playlist or whatever video that I haven't done in yonks, which is actually uh, a gearing up. So, uh, hold your horses. We're not doing anything rash here. Uh, we've got her two Bo Katana, um, two four star, and I think I've slapped the Zeta onto her. And here we go. Yes, yes, I did. I have. So, took Gar to Relic. I'm not gonna bother with the Zeta because I'm thinking he's him under. The bow lead is probably the way to go. 8% health and protection with a Zeta on there uh, when they attack out of turn. And there's speculating going on. And I keep looking at him and thinking, should I? He's gear 12 and he was there for the upgrade. Uh, so I did. Plus also, it will boost the ship stats, which I hope... In fact, I don't need to hope. I know that I cover. There you go. As if on cue. It's almost as if I did it on purpose. 155 speed there. So um, I can neither confirm nor deny that that speed may change as these, this video or videos progress. Yeah. So I thought <clears throat> I want to try it. Uh, I don't want to try it against her, or do I? Actually, scrap that, I do. Uh, I've just remembered. <laughs> and this was the battle that I opted to go into. So, slap it down to Mando's, and let's have a play. So, in she goes as lead. I think she's 233 speed. Not that should make much of a difference. Um... Got the armor in there as well. So this time round, this time round, spoiler alert, this time round we go in with Candy. I think we may change the lineup a little bit. And Sabine, there you go. But Gar's going to be a factor in both bids, if not three. I can't remember now. Yeah, I should have prepped better, but I didn't. I'm sorry. Yeah, so... Uh, not uploading lots. Yes, I do still play. Uh, not as voraciously as I have done in the past. Boom. That was that was quite brutal. Was she Relic 4? So, I'm, uh, uh, I'm liking what's happening here. We're doing the damage. Admittedly, this is in... Well, I'm doing the, uh, the hard conquest so and this is the uh the boss tier in the first one so i haven't actually done any vids of that because i normally cock it up and have to re-go in and whatnot but i'll see if i can get some recordings uh, let me know if this is of interest so um gar surviving relic three and probably modded incorrectly because I've got an offence set on him. So four of the mods are offence. Um, but yay, we did it. And I think... No, it didn't. Did we get an achievement or not? Can't see the feats. Yeah, um, uh, that being fixed would be nice. Actually see what it is that you want us to do. Rather than kind of like have to hunt it out. Okay, so... <laughs> Here's where I go a little bit pillarky, and um, there's two pilots in the gauntlet, and Super Pooper is the other partner. Yes, a pilot even, partner, whatever. Who knows what they do on their own time, eh? Um, but yeah, I, I did him too. Because I'm thinking he does a double tap sometimes. That was my my thinking on there and he's got ability block but he doesn't hit very hard so who knows this may be just a, a silly but whatever it's um he's bumped up the speed on the gauntlet which should hopefully be a good thing 
didn't even bother to clock the health and protection, but I'm assuming that they increased at the same time on the gauntlet. I can't even focus on that smaller screen, as he says. So let's go back into Conquest Sector 1. Are we going Sector 1? Yeah, we're going Sector 1. And uh, we're going to do a stupid one. Flawless victory. So I'm almost there on the feats. I just need to win four more battles without losing anyone. I believe that is what is considered as flawless. And now, of course, we're going to change it around a little bit because we've got a another Mando that I want to try. So we get the funky suits. See, I mean, <laughs> Gar was one that I kind of always want, well, not always, but I did want to do just because he's on the hunt. Yeah, exactly. See, see, there was kind of a, a reason. Uh, whether that reason is reasonable is under, well, open for debate. Oh, I'm really padding out here, sorry. Uh, I know what's about to happen. Yeah, that's not good. That's not very good either. Uh, they are hitting, getting, yeah, man down, man down. Um, so, uh, so what I can say is <clears throat> this comp at least is not very good against Geos, um, as is being demonstrated by me. This is, again, always a how not to video. And, uh, yeah, don't read it, Gar. Don't relic pooper. <laughs> uh, do I not retreat? No, I don't even get the option of falling on my own sword and forfeiting. But it's done. Um, am I going to be going in again? Why, yes, I believe I am. But I'm going to cherry pick. So let's go back and have a butcher's or visit to the Night Sisters. So, again, here's the comp. Actually, no, it's not, because we're going to switch it over and switch out Sabine and bring in Candy, I believe. Was it Candy? Yeah, Candy. So, of course... Pooper, mm, um, I'm still not sold on Pooper, but Pooper does have that ability block. Uh, so my thinking here was use it against Zombie, but of course if he's stunned, he can't do that. So hopefully he gets the opportunity at some point to do what I say. Well, not what I say, but to back that up. I do believe we inflict it once or twice. Eh, let's find out. Unfortunately, my the graphics on my recorder prevents me from seeing the options on here. And uh, I've got to be honest, I haven't memorised damn one of them. <laughs> but having fun. And I've got to be honest, this conquest is providing that. Um, we get to use different squads whatever i mean some of them get absolutely annihilated but at least you get the option of running them you know and all it's costing you is 14 energy so uh, it's good for testing unfortunately we can't see the stats and everything but nah whatever but there we go that's it gearing up done i'll stop waffling thank you for watching